three lifetimes of discovery at the Virginia Art Factory in historic Manassas, Virginia. I hope you get a chance to see it. We hang until August 30th. This painting is called Abundance. And this painting actually kind of tells the story of my time in Japan. I've lived here now for six years. And um, if you are in Japan, it's hard not to notice it's sensory overload. There's lights and there's noise and it's just a lot of, it's beautiful, but it's a lot of stimulus all at one time. So this painting kind of uh, came out of that. So it's just all the lights and all the glitz and all of that in one piece, um, but also incorporating my still life and glass. Maria, you want to tell us about your attitude painting? I follow uh, Iris F. Bell on Facebook, and if anyone knows anything about her, she is outrageous for her fashion and uh, very, very well known. And so women just post pictures of themselves in wonderful fashions. I saw this picture and I immediately uh, emailed the lady and asked if I could use the image. She said she was the photographer. And um, it's a vintage 60s jumpsuit, and I just think she has attitude. I love her look. And uh, we've become friends on Facebook now, and she is just fabulous. This little grouping is by myself, Deborah Kearse. This seashell painting, the star and dollar painting, of course, inspired by the beach. This nature's bounty painting, I like taking older things like this vintage washboard and repurposing them. If you prefer to frame this traditionally, it's just attached with Velcro, so you could pull it off easily and reattach it with a regular traditional frame. But I love the beauty in the broken and in the old, and this is an authentic washboard, as you can see. <laughs> 